I always used to finish and I want to finish again with a story from the Talmud. It's an important story. When God wanted to give the Torah to the Jewish people, the Talmud says that all the mountains, the highest and loftiest and mightiest mountains came and each one pleaded with God, let me have the honor. I want the honor. Give the Torah on my peak. And God said, no, I want to give it, I have a small mountain, its name is Sinai, and I want to give it on that mountain because I want to teach the Jew to be humble. That's the story. That's the Talmud story. But the Jew should learn to be humble. The Ger Rebbe, a great, great Torah scholar and also clever, studied this particular portion and they asked an obvious question, which I'm sure many of you have asked already. That if God wanted to, if God wanted to teach the Jew to be humble, why didn't he give the Torah in a valley? Probably the most humble possible place. Give in the valley. And he gave a better answer. He said, God wanted to teach the Jews two things. One, to be humble. Two, don't be too humble. <laughs> Never be a valley. Never be a valley. Don't let anyone step on you. Love people, all people. But don't let them step on you. The world loves us after every Holocaust. They give us monuments and plaques, and Jimmy Carter gives a, a Holocaust commission. Keep your commission, shove it. I'm tired of Kaddish. I'm tired of Kaddish and I'm tired of yard sites and I'm tired of requiem messes and I'm tired of Jews dying. Never be a valley. Be a mountain, not an arrogant mountain, but be a mountain. We don't wait for the Messiah, we bring him.